um, I'm gonna check out this place today called the Liquidation Event Center. So apparently it's um, a liquidation event that has electronics, housewares, clothing, um, toys, bedding, and tools. So um, I know my male sister already went and she got a couple good things like jackets or something and I don't know, some other stuff. But the details are on Facebook. I will link it down below. I'm so excited. Um, they close at 6 p.m. today. Today is February 24th. And here, I'm going to give you a couple details. So, yeah. Here is the event page. Liquidation Event Center. Um, so, all the details are here. I want to show you guys a photo just to get a little vibe of. It's kind of like that. So, if you've ever been to, like, Close Out King and that type of stuff. There's just a whole bunch of stuff um probably overstock items probably a lot of new things as well but it's one of those mixed bag type of events i mean you can't guarantee if everything's going to be working 100 percent but i would like to um check that out today um let me tell you the details though guys one second Doo -doo -doo. so york region is locked uh, their lockdown is lifted we are, uh, they are open from 20, February 23rd to March 3rd, which is about, I think, next Wednesday. This is at the Markham Fairgrounds. It is Boonie Town, so if you're not that used to driving, I would recommend going with someone. Um, you will definitely need to drive there. It gets really dark um, at night, so right now it gets dark around maybe 5 or 6. So yeah, there is usually lineups at those um, um, liquidation events that happen there, so dress really warm. Um... They will decrease their prices from $10 to 9 on Saturday. So right now, until the end of Friday, it's $10 per item. Saturday, it's 9 Sunday, 8 Mo Next Monday, $5. Next Tuesday, all items are $3. And next Wednesday, which is the last day, um, all items are $1. So I think it's going to be very busy that day. They have a total of 8 truckloads, 200 skids to be liquidated. And they're open to the public, um, no strollers, no backpacks, limited five, 45 minutes, shopping time per customer, um, all sales are final, and then all COVID restrictions apply, so don't forget your mask, um, and I would wear some gloves probably because, you know, it can be a lot of items um, in the store, it could get really like dusty and you might get allergies. Um, it's in the Markham Fairgrounds Building 1, so when you do arrive there, it does look like a farm area with three huge buildings you kind of have to drive in to see building one but drive in you'll see tons of cars um the address is 10801 McCowan road markham and then the hours of operation so tuesday to friday 10 to 8 p.m this saturday it's 10 to 6 sunday 10 to 5 and then next week monday to wednesday it'll be 10 to 6 p.m they take Visa, MasterCard, debit, and cash. So I'm so excited, guys, because obviously it's been a while since we've been to a store to do, like, shopping, shopping. I don't plan to get too much things, but I love looking around, um, kind of like on those garage sales. You just never know what you're going to find, something kitschy or whatever. So, yeah, um, Remove's going to pick me up. We're going to check it out. I will scope it for you guys. I'll try to film and let you know how the vibe is there so I could share it with you. So I'll see you in a bit. All right, guys, so we're on our way to the Markham Fairgrounds. We've got Ramil here, we've got Rizzle here. And actually today it's until 8 p.m. So that hour is, uh, it's 10 to 8 p.m. until Friday. And then next week, Monday to Wednesday, it's till 6. So yay, we're so excited. And I'll let you guys know how it is. Fairgrounds is somewhere in the boons. So, this part. Uh, and there's a abandoned farm. I recommend going with a friend. I do not recommend going here by yourself. 
it gets really dark. Do not go by yourself. We have arrived at the Markham Fairgrounds and it doesn't seem like there's any lineups, so let's go! Okay. So, it looks like this when you arrive. Um, you'll see a lot of cars. I'm just trying to figure out where it is. I think it's here. Yeah. So, there's not many signs. Okay, so when you first get in, you get a bag like this to sanitize your hand and your temperature gets taken. So, it looks like this. It pretty much looks like a giant garage sale. And I don't think there's a time limit. So, they have phone cases, y'all. <gasps> Ooh.
Okay guys, so for about the next 20 minutes or so, I'll just be showing you guys some items. So feel free to skip on if you don't want to get dizzy or if you think it's just boring.
sun is coming up, are you ready to go? We can take a ride, we can take it slow, yo. Well, it's my law, I'ma let you be the boss, cause I'm going
Okay, y'all, so we spent maybe an hour or two in one side of <laughs> of Marco Fairgrounds sale thing. And we're putting our bags, Herzl, show your bags. <laughs> we're putting our bags, oh my god, look, can you actually have <laughs> We're putting our bags away so we can go to the other side of building one, which is the 50% off section. So yeah, um, but overall it was really fun and apparently they put new things out every two days, uh, two days and um, what else? There's no 45 minute time limit, so I'm glad. <laughs> what crazy is the... fun. What saves you on the... <laughs> Fun. Yeah, it was pretty fun. There's a lot of random things, but there's a lot of useful things too. Like, um, I'll show you guys later what we got, but I definitely just bought things that was useful. And I'll show you what we got later too. So as you can see, they also have a lot of jackets, which I believe this is, is 50... This separate huh? um, thing from the $10 one from Amazon. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's a different... They even have a lot of shoes from Call It Spring. Yo, these are mad cute. Oh my god.
your tongue somewhere don't know what to say stop and run around oh you act like a kid i am not your mama just admit what you did i got enough to do then hang around and wait for you to grow up Ooh, and be responsible God, guys it's really hot in here so I don't know maybe don't dress up too hot when you come here oh lordy all right we are finally done we are exhausted what do you think do you recommend this place yeah it's fun it's pretty good dress light look at your hot dude Ramil, what do you have to say? The $10, the $10 side was pretty fun. Yeah. So when you go in there, take a right to um, to the 50% off side and take a left for the all $10 items. But of course, like I said, uh, the price goes down starting Saturday. All right, we'll show you what items we got in a bit. Stop up Maybe. the map, map one. Okay, so we are exhausted and we are leaving now and going home. Perfect time. What time is it? At 5 40. It's not that dark yet to uh, maybe start heading out. You don't want to be around here when it's too dark. Okay, well, uh, there's no yeah, there's no street lights around here when it, when it gets dark. So we are going to show you what we got very soon. How fun. Thank you. 
it's a good thing that they refresh it every two days because like yeah god they must have so much shit i am very interested on going next wednesday though still the dollar one yeah, yeah. That would be fun. like oh no, and you can just get whatever like even yeah. if you don't need it but you yeah Still TTC over here? Okay, so do you remember when you got it? <laughs> it's a memory seat. Oh, he got the seat cushion. Okay, and then what else? Uh, plus, because some drivers get sweaty in the summer and the, the seat gets wet. Oh, it's wet. actually kind of gross. Yeah, that's my instructor recommended this okay. to get that. And we got a wireless charger for the phone. Okay guys, I'm so exhausted, oh my gosh. So I'll just show you what we got. Ate got a, an umbrella. It's the one where it opens like in reverse. So I'll show you guys a picture here. Um, all the items we got were $10. Um, this is another thing that Ate got. It's something for your posture. I think it's a, yeah, back stretcher. Stretcher. Um, I got this tripod i feel like it's still really good quality and also it's a nice in a nice small bag where i can easily fit in my knapsack which y'all know i really really need that um and it's really lightweight so yeah i always need a tripod and yeah and like your bag gets really heavy when you have so many equipments already so yeah then i got this airbrush thing for cake decorating and cookie decorating so what you put inside I think is food coloring but this airbrush is also um good for makeup or whatever um it was slightly opened so I, I was taking a risk on that but um I know all the parts are in there next I got this huge bag which I'm so happy with um it's a cake stand thing so uh, yeah where you serve cakes on and there's so many in it um i think there's four different sizes 5 10 15 20 so i think there's 20 four different sizes i'm really happy with that that goes um that's just it gets really expensive then this here is one of those like photo shoot boxes Ugh, so hard to show you guys. Um, it's a mini like photo shoot box thing. Oh my God. Jesus. Um, so you can take a nice photo of like probably what I, I'll be taking photos of are like my cookies or just like smaller desserts. So that was also ten dollars. What else you got here? And then Aki just got some art things. So this looked really sick. It's um a Japanese product. Apparently, um, but it's like a watercolor pad with lots of watercolor markers at the back. Um, so yeah, those get kind of expensive. Um, and then another marker pack, which we always need. So yeah, overall my impressions, um, it was really, really fun if you like that type of kind of shopping. Um, like garage sale shopping. So if you like that stuff, then you'll have a lot of fun. It is really hot in there, so I recommend um, you either taking off your jacket before you go inside. Um, once you do get inside, they will take your temperature and they will ask you to put some sanitizer on and make sure that you have your mask on. Um, and then there's two sides, like I said, so once you enter in and you take a left, that will be the room, this large room of um, $10 items, which I told you the prices will 
um, decreased throughout the week. And then on the right side, you will get all the items that are 50% off. So there's a lot more um, items there that are high quality, like Swarovski items, name brand perfumes, um, down jackets, and other things like boots and stuff from the store call it spring so yeah those are a little bit more pricier but still good deal i've also seen some like projectors and stuff um which i was really contemplating but i didn't want to overspend so um yeah so i think i really boiled down to um just essential items that i'm actually going to use and need in the next few months some tips. Apparently, they're going to put new items every two days, and then next Wednesday is the dollar item, so I'm like kind of really wanting to go that day. We'll see. Um, but today, there was no lineups. It wasn't cold, um, so it was good if there was a lineup, but no lineups. Um, everyone was super nice and helpful. Yeah, so I hope you guys check it out. It was really fun. Um, I'm so exhausted because I'm not used to shopping all day anymore. But um, there was a lot of useful, useful items as well. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. It was super fun to do. And see you in the next one. Bye.